everybody and welcome back to my Daisha playthrough in the Imperator Augustus campaign. My name is Ben Pope and let's see we... One second here, let me turn on a timer so I don't keep recording forever. Right, so as I was saying, I am slowly wrapping up this campaign. Uh, we're capturing uh, territory from the rebels at this point in um, the peninsula of Italy and um, the rebels are just kind of giving the Macromani a hard time out here so I might have to actually help him some more even on the north northern side um, I still have the iron wolves uh, the army called the iron wolves training up units uh, which I might use them but uh, when it all comes down to it uh, there's there's only so much I can do. Let me show you here. As I was saying, so all these people are friendly. Um, they have no choice but to be friendly because they're strappy of these other guys. And I'm friendly with Anthony. Uh, Tracia is a client state of. Anthony, I could take him out. That might get. They don't like. I mean, they don't even like Anthony's room that much. So I'm not sure if they'll be mad or what. But um, attitude is 158. Very friendly. I don't really want to mess that up. Um, I'm friendly with the Iberians, the Pompey's room, Egypt. So if I was to, yeah, I just gotta show you this so you understand. Okay, for the ultimate victory, I would have to capture. Um, I guess I don't have allies with the Norie. I should have allies with Norie. Defensive allies. Welcome! We will talk and then we will feast until our guts. Right, anyway, so that might be possible, but. Where is it? Um, this isn't possible. Pitney and Panthus, because what they did with this campaign is. I, I have no options for... Welcome, welcome, my friend. Um, I will give ear to you and give tongue to the people's words. I have no option to uh, offer lions to Anthony's room. I'm not sure if that's buggy because of uh, mods I have, or if that was intended. I haven't tried this without mods. Um, it could be something that is caused... I have diploma, I have diploma, uh, diplomatic diplomacy mod. Uh, I have Dresden's diplomacy mod, which allows me to say, "Hey, I want to, you know, going to be my client state or strappy," uh, and it gives me the options to sack and, and raise and all that stuff when capturing a, a settlement. But I can't become allies with the, any of the Roman states, so it's not just this the state; it's any of the Roman states. Same thing. On behalf of our people, welcome. Which means that I could, I could be friendly and I could have non-aggression and trade, but nothing else. So then any of these, um, you know, hey, you must control that province by alliance or capturing it. Um, it just doesn't, I just can't do it. So I would have to fight these people. And I really don't have time for that. I don't, I feel like I accomplished enough in this campaign. And if that was to work, if my diplomacy was to work, I could do... Um, sorry, I meant to go in here. I could easily do the military, I, you know, that would give me a few more settlements here and maybe I can capture more. And to have the total of 90. And um, yeah, and I'll be able to accomplish that. I, this one is kind of tough because of the 90,000 talents a turn. So that's kind of hard to do, uh, but again here with, um, I guess I would have to just befriend it. I'll actually do alliance, not just defensive alliance with Egypt, 
and then um, I would have to fight these guys here and the same with the cultural uh, Tracia is control following provinces yeah so I couldn't I would have I would, I would have to fight the Tracians for sure but then Navisos is not part it's part of Tracia or is it I don't know if it is in this campaign anyway um, and then this is even a bigger problem because it's Athena and Sparta and Pharsalus. This area, I would have to fight Anthony, which sure, I can fight Anthony, but I should be able to just say, hey, you are completely friendly, very friendly. Why don't we just be allies and call it a day? So, yeah, see the province of Thracia would include Nevisos there. So technically, I have accomplished those goals, except for maybe not holding all the required units. Um, settlements in which, or provinces in which your culture is dominant, so that would have to improve and build that specific building. So we're gonna, we're gonna just go for a couple of turns here and get some more. Uh, just gonna see what the flow of what what what's this public order? Sure, we're all like adventuring. Right, let's do that. So we're gonna go for a couple of turns, maybe take take out some more of the rebels and instate some order. And uh, our faction leader is on his way to Rome. And we're gonna upgrade Dacia a bit more, so it's a powerhouse. And I haven't decided how I'm gonna end it. I might just be like, okay, yay, we're... You know, I'm satisfied with what I accomplished and that's kind of how I feel. Or I could do something crazy like, demolish everything! would be kind of kind of odd for me to do I like I would feel weird with doing that um, but if you guys want to see that if you guys want to see hey I'm just gonna retract all my armies back into Dacia and demolish everything else and uh, let the world burn because I made my riches if you want to see that <laughs> let me know in the comments <laughs> yeah it's a, it's a busy week this week. I haven't been able to, like yesterday, I didn't do any Total War stuff on my channel. Um, and yeah, I'm just doing a lot of things. It's kind of the winter season, I guess, does that to you. Uh, and there's a lot of content out there. Like you can just sit and watch, for example, the Yawks guests in their, in their holiday stream, which they're streaming all, all month of December every day. Uh, are those guys on my land? Mission aborted. Assassinate. Uh -huh. I guess she's... Uh... My nation is multilingual. Alright, that's good. Well How is Bertigala going? Uh, okay, let's see if we can improve income somewhere. That would be a good one to improve income with. I'm using up a lot of food. Uh, I'll just leave those be. Uh, these rebels are growing, aren't they? I don't know, we'll let the Macromani in there. What do they have? Club levies. Oh, they have a mercenary trust and hoplite. Okay. Alright, techie technology. We're gonna do uh, this one. Although I probably won't get to finish it. Okay. They were in Force March. We're just gonna go down there. Uh, 
you're still following. Okay. Is it is it that harsh of a winter? Yeah. Desertion. Minus public order. Minus the growth. Minus to agriculture. How are we, two food. Could use the extra food there, but I'll hold on. Uh, you sir. Ready for orders. I don't know. I think you have enough. Um. What's it called? Enough. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Get moving, you Infantry. Rich. Put you in here. For the and then here we can train some archers and some siege. Darn good siege. Ready for orders. Mercenaries are meh. They are the they have the ocean, the ocean, station bowmen. Okay, let's see. Are you guys taking attrition out here? You are not. Was there a? Is there an army? I saw an army of these guys. Must be these guys. Yep. Yeah. yeah, why don't you defend your town? Huh? Alright, let's just go back home here. And I think we can end the turn. Riders of the wave have leveled up. Um, I suppose. Hmm. Don't I have some of these that are like, um, Camp administrator. Is that gonna give me? Nope. Well, whatever. We could do with um, better, better skills when training something. If I do need a, a fleet somewhere, which I could bring that down to. Mediterranean area. I don't have any boats. Lots of activity um, on, I guess it's December 2nd, just today, which by the time this video comes out, it might be yesterday. There was a new uh, trailer released by creative assembly for Total War Attila and I enjoyed it. It was about the red horse of the Sassanid Empire and how they're gonna take advantage of um, the conflicts that are you know kind of pressuring the Eastern Roman Empire up north and everywhere else and they're gonna take advantage of that and attack them and um it's using. Wow. Well, these guys are losing their fight. Oh no, my best buy has died. Oh no. Well, these spies are old. That guy was. I am the knife in the dark. This guy's 38. That guy was like 60 something. That guy was older than my faction leader. Who is 57? He was like 63 last I looked at it. So that spy has ceased to be 
of course, you can't go back and look at anything uh, that he was. It's just he just gets erased from memory, which, what would you have of which me? is lame. But um, sabotage. Success. In uh, Total War Attila, that's gonna change because you'll, you'll have. Actually, I don't know about the agents, but all your other people are gonna be in the family tree. So you can see when he passed away and, and how Thirsty old he was and all that jazz, so that'll definitely help with um with everything. Guess I'm going for powerhouse in the Roman um Latium province. Everything else is kind of good. I think my... Where am I? Here. Uh, this can use another... Food. Actually, I don't know. This is gonna... I'll still be fine with food. So increase increase my money. Let's do that. Okay. You have your home in Rome, obviously. Uh, okay. Was the faction was, this, was it destroyed? Was Anthony's Rome or sorry? Inspired populace. I don't have anything about. So there is a, a Octavian Rome. Octavian's Rome, something's still roaming around here. Octavian's Rome is roaming. Is this my, um... I think it's the, he's the young kid, isn't he? No, he is, um... His other chief, Sina. I, I thought it was this guy. I'm at 47%. Oh well. Skills. Got some authority. <laughs> Where are you? There you are. Deep peace to you. Oh, he's rank 10, isn't he? Mm hmm. I'll keep the military. Well, uh, tax rate. Yeah, well, let's just go with this. Who cares about taxes? I have a noble master. I guess that's the first ever dignitary I leveled out of 10. That's interesting. I think the TTT mod, the, the traits, toads, and toadies, uh, which are. Actually, that's not that's not what's helping. That's helping the generals feel more attached to your generals. But just because I'm because I have a four turns per year mod, that's really helping the agents stay around longer and um, just get more more benefits out of them. They actually, you know, they level up a bit more. They get more skills because you get four times the amount of turns to. When it turns to uh, do stuff in with them, so these guys are running back home. Ah, oh, excuse me, yawning. All right, let's see what happened. We have a, a 
Oh, they're taking a tree that's level 9. Board of Offering, we have some probably some public order and... Whatever. Normally, okay, there it is. Public order and morale. Okay, war declared between Pompey and the media. On seasonal conditions. It's a warm summer. I don't know how that's unseasonal. Is it warmer than normal? Actually, we have summer around here, but it's not usually that warm all the time, and now it's just unusual. Uh, let's see. Is it these guys? Um, very friendly. My friend, be welcome. The spirits of this place smile upon you. The gods bless you. I just want to see if this is even possible. Like, will they actually accept? Six grand and you're still not accepting alliance? I'm also curious about... You guys. I have little gain in wasting the day on you. What you say had better please my ears. You're a retard. Be happy I'm not killing you. Oh, now you would you would take a peace treaty for seven grand, huh? Something I must have changed their mind because I tried this before. I can sense that my guards smile on us and our agreement. Oh come on, face. I am sure face, that your stupid. wares will find a home somewhere, but not with us. Yes, thing. your words show wisdom beyond your Quit years. Retarded. I knew your people to be honorable. Maybe, maybe it won't happen right away. Yeah. How about a non-aggression? With some payment? You speak as well as a bard, but I'm... I do speak as well as a bard, thank you. <laughs> Come on, take my non-aggression. Um... Yo, people! Fine. Fine. What's interesting is, uh, I'm gonna go back here. There might be a bug with my uh, diplomacy mod because I'm not having. Welcome. The we will talk and then we will feast join. until our guts rumble and our backsides oh, ache from overuse. Stop talking, jeez. All right. So I have same blood with these guys, and I should be able to offer confederacy, but that's not an option. So maybe I have something buggy. Either way, uh, that is that. I'm not friendly with these guys. They declared war on me on like. Day one, really. It was like turn two or three to go back and watch. Um, does anyone need public order? Move this army somewhere. Oh, let's move you into here. Why not? Oh, into here. The capital should always have some military. How do we do? It is we did alright. Uh, let's get our... Let's get our faction leader. Some auto resolve action. Right. What would you well, that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, next episode, we're gonna take out these rebels. And uh, do let me know if you wanna see me do something drastic with my campaign at the end. 
or just call it as I mentioned, just sort of be happy with what I accomplished and um, technically those objectives should be met, but they're not. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. If you watched this far, please hit the like button, comment, and if you're not subscribed, be sure to subscribe. And I'll see you guys around uh, starting next week. I'll have a new uh, campaign replacing this campaign, depending on what you voted for in that um, faction vote video. So if you haven't done that yet, go ahead and do that. And I'll see you guys. Bye.